Okay, I've got 64 fuel rods, Isaac, and eight control rods. Therefore, we can have eight sets of rods, eight deep or yes. long, mm -hmm. depending on how you want to, you know, start to phrase that. Should I just make as many fuel rods as I can? I think that you should firmly decide on a reactor size and then work within the confines of the decision that you've made. Okay, let's see how much more glass we've got, or quartz. I wouldn't start by just making a ton of stuff and then deciding on a size. I would do it the, the other way around, if, if, if at all possible. Yeah. Yeah, we don't have any more. That's fine. I, I do quite like the idea of eight and eight for now. Um, So we'll do that. And then we can always extend later, right? Yeah, for sure. Like downwards, I reckon. Um, Like lengthways, which will require minimal rebuilding you just cut the floor out extend the fuel rods put the floor back on boom you've got a bigger reactor you understand what i mean yeah 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 i i, I fully understand where you're coming from with this my friend. excellent all right let's do this let's do this thing all right so eight by eight so i guess i'll build are you doing a uh, are you doing an eight by eight by eight like a cube uh correct wait yes wait wait you ah oh, okay, so you have Oh, actually, no, I'm not. I'm not doing eight by eight by eight. You're doing... I'm I'm doing... <laughs> okay, <laughs> right. Hold on a second. <laughs> so, I've got eight control rods and yes. 64 fuel rods. Yes, which means if you wanted to, you could have eight strips. You could have eight, like, fuel rods, right? Like, eight long, yeah, tall... Yeah, right now, it's more like eight by eight by two, right? Well, you're not... Look, the reactor needs space for coolant. Yes, yes, yes. I, okay. I I understand. Yeah. Right. <laughs> let's um let's map this out. Let's let's map this out. Okay. I mean, Nick, do do you have my uh, my stream open? I do. It's not actually playing right now. Um, let me restart that, and then we can we can do this. I now have your stream open. Okay. Perfect. Here is uh, here is Paint in Windows. <laughs> okay. Okay. Amazing. I want you to put this in the episode as well. Nick, don't you worry, it's going in. So we're going to go <laughs> with a, a square reactor design. Is that the plan? Um, like, you want to go square or do you want to go rectangular? Or do you want to go, like, what kind of, you know, how, how are we talking? Ooh, square. Let's go square. Perfect square. Okay. So if we have eight things, right? If we have eight, that's, that's, that's a bad, that bad one right there. Um, if we have eight, let me use the line tool here. If I can figure this out, there we <laughs> he's go. He's an artist. Look at look you at this. You can tell check. he's an artist. Look at this. <laughs> so I'm just trying to figure out how many uh, things we would need, right? Like this one. Don't worry about the, the the width disparities here. This is like a one, two, three, four, five, six. I feel like at the very least we want to go with maybe like a. This is gonna be a lot easier if I just stop caring about how straight it is. Uh, I feel like at the very least we want to go with maybe a seven. Okay. But that's because I feel like. The number you have is actually not that many. No, no. This is what I've realized because eight control rods and 64 fuel rods would make like one eighth of that. Do you understand? Yeah. Do you get like, it? If we, yeah. Did a, if we did a five by five. So if it was one, two, three. One, two, three. Is that right? One, two, three, five. <laughs> you really, you really lost. You really lost the creative, uh, creative accuracy with this second one, Isaac. Uh, uh, <laughs> then in in here, <laughs> that bottom one. Oh, oh, it's good. In no, keep going, keep in going. Here, if we did like you know one, two, three, four. Five. I didn't six, know we were playing seven, and crosses, eight. Isaac. We, we're I mean, crosses, crosses is winning, man, like massively. <laughs> um, you know, we probably want something like this, I think, right? And so even a five by five requires quite a lot of um of of fuel rods, right? Yeah. Like oh, oh sorry, fuel reactor ports, whatever the top bit block is called. So those those are the control rods. So we need three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen control rods. Yeah, if we're gonna go with with this kind of you can also do 12, I guess. Like, obviously, if you flip them, if you moved all the X's to where the whites are and the whites to where the X's are, you could do 12 rods True. and 8 empties. And would 12 be better? Because it would mean that, you know, the four ones at the four corners, they're only getting two sides of coolant, right? I think that's fine. Is that fine? Okay. Yeah, I, I, I back 13. I think 13 is fine. Right. So I'm just thinking, if we do want it to be 8 
deep, then that would require 13 times 8 fuel rods, which is uh, 130 minus 26, which is 104, right? 104 fuel rods. I currently have 64. So I just need to double the amount of, essentially double the amount of reactor fuel rods I have. Okay. The Twitch chat has made a good point, Nick, in that there is a big reactor simulator ah. that we can utilize. So here's our reactor. Look at this. Look at this. So we can, you know, we can simulate here where we're going to put the rods. Oh, that's beautiful. I know, right? Look at that. So that was our plan. Uh, and then, you know, we could if we wanted to just because we have them and we can, you know, flex. We could put diamond blocks in as our coolant. Oh, yeah, of course. The sky's made of them, Isaac. We have to. Yeah. And you have you said this is five deep? This Yeah, this is a five by five by five. This is a perfect, uh, okay. a perfect yeah, cool. cubazoid perfect. right here. Yeah. And we can, you know, we can simulate here, I think, or, or fill. Yeah. In that case, we only need five times 13 um, fuel rods, which is... Um, uh, 50, 65. Oh, that's perfect. I need one more fuel rod for that to work. So this is great. And you can see by, by default, this is 18,000 RF per tick. Ah, right. And it uses 0.43 millibuckets per tick of eulorium. And is which like is fine also efficient or something yeah okay that's amazing because that's more than enough power to power our machines up full upgrade and have plenty to spare i guess let's start freaking let me make two more stacks of casing um because we don't have all of the casing yet however we are pretty much there isaac which is great. All right. I'm going to close that down now. I hope everyone enjoyed the uh, the simulation there. This is great. Oh, I'm just so happy we have so much coal. I think before when we've made these things right, mm. coal has been like the limiting factor and the speed at which we've been processing it. Right, right. Sure. The fact now that we have so much coal in the system and that the fact that we've got, you know, these redstone furnaces that are like insane the upgrades. I'm just going to freaking time in a bottle these bad boys too. Go for it, man. Go for it. Do keep, do keep an eye on the current time you have. But uh, yes, yes. Yeah, go for it. It's, it's so good. I'm not even put augments in these things. Here we go. There we freaking go. Oh, yeah, that really ate through the power, didn't it? That's. Uh, oh, well, you making more graphite? Is that what's being made here? Yeah, I'm making loads of right, graphite. Yeah. We do need one more access port, I think, because I'm pretty sure we need one access port to feed the Elorium in and then another one to pull, like, the cyanide out, is it? And is that another yellow-coloured access port and not, like, a coolant port or anything? It's another yellow-coloured access port, but you right-click it and it becomes, like, a blue access port that exports uh, as opposed I to see, imports. Yeah. Cool. I've got it. I've got it. Perfect. So that's fine. Right, we need one more stack of casing. Let's make that right now. How is the uh, graphite made? Are you just smelting coal? Like, what's the... I'm just smelting coal, yeah. Using our, um, just some of the pre-existing redstone furnaces nice. that are meant to produce. I yeah, see, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, that's um, that's good. I think I've got the goods, man. Um, I need one more fuel rod, actually. I'll come put the casing in for you. Oh, sorry, the graphite in. There you go. It's in the system for Thank you. Thank you. Need it. Beautiful. Right, let's, uh, let's do this. There we go. Seven by seven. So we'll just... Uh, here we go. Uh, the, right. uh, Nick, Nick, let's get a uh, freaking building wand, man. Oh, yeah. Right. You get the building wand. Here we go. I'll build the first layer. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, You've done this in six, the most awkward way possible. Seven. Yeah, don't, don't worry about it. Right? <laughs> one you, side, then the other, then the other. Then yeah. Here's your wand, man. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you know, you got to... It's like... Um, you know when uh, you, you're screwing like something in that uses four screws, Isaac, and you can't really ram in one corner and then the pressure will be different across yeah, each one? Yeah, yeah. This is, that's what I was doing. Oh, you know what I hate, man? More like so much is when you, you come across like a bald screw, like a screw that's had its, uh, its shape. Like someone's like used a screwdriver wrong on it too much or something like that and like oh, the screw doesn't have its yeah. shape anymore so you can't get your screwdriver in. The thing just doesn't move and it's just like, oh, the nightmare, man. Awful. Awful. Absolute nightmare. Uh, yeah. Okay. So are we doing... Are we doing... You've built it... I don't like how you've built this, man. Like, the fact that you built it one down is, like, super weird. <laughs> but it'll don't work. Worry, it's fine. It's fine. Because um, remember, if we want to expand, Isaac, we can expand downwards. So sure. this would go down anyway. We can also expand upwards. Do you want to put the reactor... Sorry, the controller Ooh. here. Uh, yes. One second. Let me grab that. So controller goes there. Yeah. Let's put, like, a, an access port on either side. Either side. Yep. Back it. So one there, one there. 
Uh, then let's go ahead and throw down the uh, the fuel rods in the middle. While you do that, I'll go and check on uh, diamond quantities. Right, so... One, two, three. One, two. One, two, three. We've got over 7,000 diamonds, man. Oh, my goodness. And, like, the, I'm assuming you can just pull it out in block form as well, because... Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, you, do you want... Oh, that's not right. Uh, I guess... You know what, Nick? Let me get a wand real quick, and we can, like... Tag team wand build this. Yeah, like you do the diamonds, I do the yeah, fuel rods. Yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. This is good. This is good. And we have to do that four times. Yeah, we're only going five high, right? Yeah. Okay. Which is oh, nice. no, wait. Uh, yeah. That's correct. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, do you want to put did you want to do yours? Yeah. There we go. I'll do mine. You do yours. I'll do mine. Actually, we can do these independently of each other. This doesn't have to be done like this, but it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. So that's that's okay. that, right? Yeah. Yep. I am fresh out of fuel rods. Perfect. Do you want to throw me the casing? I'll do that while you put the control rods down. Yeah. There you go. Uh, I'll give you the I'll give you the rest, actually. I think you need more, Isaac. There's more. There's more. Oh, there's, so much of it. There's more. There you go. I think you took, maybe took a bit back there, but that's fine. Yeah, it's all right. I'm sure, I'm sure it'll be all right. Okay. Fuel rods go on here. Or oh, control rods, even. Oh, oh! I forgot to make the the, the final control rods. Let me go make those. We need thirteen, not eight. Do we have reactor glass for the front, or I'm making this? We do not have reactor glass for the front. I will try and make some reactor glass for the front. Yes, that would be ideal. While you do that, I'll make the control remaining control rods. Did you use, you use all the hardened glass? Yeah, for those. Oh um, wow! Yeah, for the fuelies. For oh. the fuelies, took up a lot. I've got 16 fused quartz, which I'll put in to, to aid the cores. Okay. But yeah, it won't, uh, it won't help for much. I think that'll make eight eight glass uh, reactor right. glass. That's actually not too bad, because I don't think we need that much glass. Like, obviously, I think we're going to need more than eight, but we don't need a ton. No, we don't need a ridiculous amount, do we? No. Although eight might be uh, right, not might quite chop. enough. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, okay. This is actually... This is fine. Is this built? This is built to spec, right? This is going to be I fine. I think it's built to spec. Okay. It's built to spec to me. Okay. I I believe your eyes, my friend. Thanks, man. Thanks. This is a this is a this is a whole new experience, Nick. You know, we're never this productive. I know. This is the quickest we've ever <laughs> built a reactor. It's great. I mean, this, this is. is... <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Uh, we need to like take a break, Isaac. <laughs> Minutes played. <laughs> we're like <laughs> combined. We're like thirty hours into the game. <laughs> we've just got the reactor down. So, I mean, <laughs> I don't know if it's the fastest we've built it in that sense of the word, but... Uh, no, 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 no. Oh, I, I think it is. I think it is. Okay. Uh, I'm I'm not going to... I'm going to have to burst a bubble here, Nick, in that uh, we don't have... We're going to have to hold off on the glass production. Yeah, I thought so. It's... Uh, you know, yeah, but, hold on. We can... we can No, we can... <laughs> I was going to leave it looking horrendous, but we can, uh, we can at least do, like, a cool pattern. Yeah, we can do a bit. Yeah, let's do something like this... Right, and have like a cross at the front. Yeah, that would do. Yeah. Um, actually, quick question. Where do we want the power tap? So that's a good point, actually. I think maybe like on the back. Oh, on the back. Okay. I think we yeah. can just hide it. We do have knobbly ends installed. Oh, uh, so we can, uh... do we? Oh. Nick, we've got, we got 400 mods, man. we got all the mods. That's true, actually, yeah. TM, we can't say that, Nick. That's a Yeah, we can't. A don't, get a, don't get it twisted, Isaac. <laughs> that's the wrong mod pack. <laughs> we have a vast quantity of mods. There we go. There Avast we go. is a registered trademark of the Avast Corporation. <laughs> okay. Oh, God, what have I done? It's all right. It's all right. I've got... It's oh, so you've done bad. it. Okay. <laughs> oh, I thought that cross was going to be, like, symmetrical, but it's No, not. You, what you've done there, Isaac, is you've deliberately made it unsymmetrical by, like, what looks like one block, but either way you do it, it will look unsymmetrical. Oh, no. Oh, uh, no, I hate it, man. I hate it. Yeah, it's, it's quite awful, it's isn't so it? It's so bad. But, but, you know, it's temporary, uh, Isaac. It's temporary. We'll get it fixed okay. uh, for, for next time. <laughs> <laughs> if you insist, man. Let's have a look here. So I have the Crescent Hammer, so I think I can change the, uh, like, one of these ports to an output port. Like this. Oh, no, you can just right click and then turn it to output. There we go. Oh, nice. nice. So if I put Eulorium in the input port, that's now got Eulorium in there. I'm going to grab even more. Yeah, just fill it. Oh, yeah. Fill it right up. I think the more fuel it has, the the more power it'll produce. Okay, that's good. I'll, oh, yeah, uh, look I'll at get that. some as well. Oof. Oh no! Don't you worry, my friend. It's it's. Oh, you got it all. You yeah, it all yeah. in. Oh yeah! Look at that. It's full. All right. Are you? Uh, do you want to do the honors, my friend, of, of turning this on? 
I'm going to push the big button. I'm assuming it's this one that says activate reactor. That's the one. Oh, look at that. Oh. Right up at 18,000 redstone flux per tick. God, that got up there quick, didn't it? Yeah, I think Jeez. I think the reactor explodes if it gets above like 5,000 Celsius. So I think we're okay. Like okay, that's well good. within the, the to, range. Seems to not be going above 2,000, which is good. We'll see what happens when it... It won't the keep, energy I buffer. think it'll just keep burning, which is a problem. So like, yeah, yes. we'll keep burning it. We can get, and you know, maybe this is something we can look at in the next stream, uh, but we can get like a redstone port and so we could do some like power management where we check how full a battery is and then if it's too full, we turn it off. And then yeah. when it falls below a certain percentage, we turn it back on and, you know, kind of try and reserve our fuel that way a little bit. Basically create the national grid, Isaac, in our exactly, own backyard. Yeah, yeah, I love it. When we anticipate that everyone's going to put their kettles on, just go ahead and Flick you know, it on. whack it on for a bit. Mm. Yeah, jobs are good. <laughs> Amazing. Wow. Well, well, there you go, Nick. That's uh, It's a big old power cube that we've built here. I um, love it. A little bit more interesting than even more dynamos, but combined with the dynamos, Nick, we do have uh, you know close to twenty five thousand RF per tick being uh, being produced there, which is a grand. And with that, guys, we're gonna go ahead and uh, wrap up the Sky of Diamonds portion of today's stream there.